down periscope and there's a well-trained enemy crew, man the stations, they're ready to prepare for the complicated procedure to a torpedo attack. The torpedo officer warns his commander, on target, 1800 yards, reduce it. Fire, one. Fire, two. And there go the torpedoes, streaking slap bang, streaking through the water, slap bang amidships of our ship, poor old British drive. Can you see, kids? I can put your dust glasses on. There's two torpedoes heading slap bang for the middle of our ship, poor old British pride. I hear anything to happen to our ships. I can't watch this. I'm a bit of a coward in these situations. So I'm sorry. I'm going to have to turn my head away. I shouldn't have think what's going to happen. submarine decides to finish off the now helpless vessel with her deck runners. Now that's not plain fair. Let's give them a big gulp for that. One, two, three. I should think so. Oh, the gunners are on the found the range straight in there. It's like a pair ground of shooting galleries. They can't make it. Easy peasy. Look at the state of our there. She's a... oh, what an absolute oh I don't know that black smoke. Oh, what an absolute mess is it? She was laid from stem to stern and she's keeled over. That's it. We just lost the ship. Now the British pride, with her engines and boilers gone, slowly settles in the water. Altogether, a big R for the poor old British pride, one, two, three. Bigger R than that, we've just lost a ship. Now come on, one, two, three. Come on, it's stopped raining. With everything's A-OK. Well, it's not A-OK, it's a disaster. What an absolute shame. 